I'm Stacey Meadwell, I'm the Focus Editor of Estates Gazette. I'm here in sunny Bath and about to go on a sneak peek of Phase 2 of Multi-Development and Aviva Investors Southgate Scheme in the city centre. Southgate is Aviva Investors and Multi-Development's 400,000 square foot retail scheme. Phase 1 opened in November. Phase two opens next month, with the final phase opening in September. Effectively, what we're going to end up with here is an entire uh, new public space, a new square in Bath. I think the architecture reflects the history of Bath. Um, it's not going to become dated. It's a fantastic city. The opportunity to redevelop eight acres in the World Heritage Site is unique, and we just see this as being a long-term, very good investment. But how tough has it been bringing a scheme to the market during a recession? The retail market has suffered immensely. Uh, rental values have fallen significantly, obviously, in, uh, in existing schemes. Um, we have managed that process during development by reviewing our, our Zone A's at regular interviews, sort of every six months over the last 18 months. Uh, it's probably been easier for us to adjust, as it's not a scheme that's already fully open and operational. Uh, we managed to sort of adjust tenant mix uh, and, and adjust some of the contract terms that we would take some of the clauses, maybe have a, a, a mutual break clause in them. So if the deal wasn't the perfect deal we wanted, uh, the retailer does have the opportunity to, to move away. But we also have the opportunity to say, right, well, we'll take it back now uh, and lease it maybe in three years' time when there's a recovery in, the, in, in sight. So um, in general, we've all been hit. Uh, but I think, again, as it is phased, we haven't seen that really reflected in the quality of the tenants here. What sort of rents have you been achieving? Um, again, over the last year, it won't surprise you to hear, it's been quite, quite varied. Um, we found probably over the last four or five months that things are beginning to settle as we secured the majority of our MSUs now, um, all of our, our MSUs have gone, that we're probably looking at settling around about the 250 mark. The last couple of deals are coming in at, at that mark. We'll probably look at um, doing one or two probably either side of that, but try and look at settling the rents around about 250. In terms of phase two, how much of phase two is left to let? Uh, in phase two, we have uh, about 12 units remaining uh, and we have six uh, offers on those 12 units and we have uh, interest in the rest of those units as well. What sort of incentives have you been offering retailers? Well, we've been working very closely with the retailers and uh, looking at the cost of their shop fit. It's not just uh, an incentive that's relative to the rent that they pay. Uh, we have uh, scrutinised very carefully how much it costs them to shop fit and we have worked with them to generally fund uh, a good percentage of that, uh, of that cost.